Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Office Blog Daz. Office Blog Aiden. I'm Gainer. All right, one thing we love, <clears throat> right, is gadgets in our house, don't we? Do we? Yeah. Do we? All, yeah, we buy loads of gadgets. Got loads of stuff. We got, in the, the kitchen, kitchen there's loads of gadgets in the kitchen. Yeah, stuff, yeah we buy a lot of house gadgets, don't we? Um, Do you know what I can't but, find though? I've been looking for years and years. A thing that takes the stone out the middle of an olive or a cherry. What? Never even heard of such a thing. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, these are ten illegal gadgets that you can actually buy. Right. And with Christmas coming up soon, yes. let's see what you can get. Let's go for it. Illegal gadgets that you can buy. The internet is a wide and open space, especially when it comes to retail. And while you wouldn't expect high-risk and prohibited products to be easily accessible on selling sites like Amazon, there are still some items that could be purchased on the platform despite the product being somewhat outside the law. Here are some illegal gadgets that you can buy. Number 10, Car Key Grabber. There are almost 2,000 cars that get stolen or broken into in the United States every day. This could be because the technology that automakers put in cars to make them more convenient to use also allow thieves to grab the same vehicles uh, with the wow. same convenience. That's a big thing now, These isn't newer it? model cars using. are equipped with keyless entry and keyless start, allowing motorists to unlock their vehicles and start the cars without taking their key fob out of their pocket. This fob communicates with the car by emitting a code that's picked up by an antenna inside your vehicle. The thing is, there's a device known as a car key grabber that can easily be bought online. This grabber receives and records the code emitted by the fob and transfers the data onto a booster, wow. allowing the user to trick the car into thinking the authentic key fob is near. This allows thieves to enter your vehicle without it's having to manually manipulate a door <laughs> and can easily allow them to start the engine and drive away. That's why you got to make sure you don't have anyone holding on to these grabbers nearby when you use your key fob so it won't be able to catch the code. Number 9. Lawmate Clip Camera While it's mostly used for surveillance purposes, no ordinary person would generally walk around the neighborhood with a clip-on camera. So if you're looking for a discreet way to capture quality really videos, discreet, then go it? with the law main type. if you looked at that, you wouldn't think it is a camera. No, no it's like you wouldn't. a tie pin, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, it's a tie clip, isn't it? Mm. The tie clip hidden camera is designed to complement your existing wardrobe while functioning as a full-color covert hidden camera. This battery-powered gadget is able to capture 550 lines of resolution and can simply be plugged into a DVR for immediate playback. Number 8. Multi-Pick Kronos Lock-picking may be a necessary skill to those who need it, but it can also pose a dangerous threat, especially when the one picking the lock has less than good intentions, which is why it can be more than imposing when tools that make picking locks easier can also be found on the internet. The Kronos electric lock-pick gun from Multi-Pick is the most popular product from the company providing state-of-the-art electronics and a powerful motor that make it the quietest electronic pick on the market. Does doesn't say how much they are though. I've seen the other one, it said like 5,000. Yeah. But it doesn't yeah, say how much these are. Yeah, you'd have to go and look yourself to see how much they are. Yeah, because if, if they're really expensive, then a lot of people are not going to buy them. I don't know, because if you, if you think if you think about that car key fob, right, for say 10, 5... It's an investment. Day, it's an yeah. investment yeah. if you're stealing cars. You know what I mean? Two or three cars and that's paying for itself. Yeah. Designed, engineered and manufactured in Germany, it has all the power you need to open most four, five and six pin cylinder locks with a compact and lightweight design that makes the Kronos easy to grip while operating it. Number 7. Destruct Hard Drive Data Eraser If you're hesitant with the factory reset you've just made on your computer's hard drive, then claim assurance from illegally recovered data with this Destruct Hard Drive Data Eraser. Reformatting a computer's hard drive often makes old data rewritable, which doesn't really assure that all secure data has been purged from your mm. system. The Destruct Data Eraser provides permanent data destruction, allowing you to secure a true master reset to completely and permanently erase documents and files. This device is a military-grade data eraser that lets you get rid of confidential files and data that may be stored on your computer, so that you can have the peace of mind you need before releasing any of your gadgets to anyone else. Number 6. SRTYH Listening Device 
This simple operation gadget, which serves as a listening device for construction and repairs, can also be used in more ingenious schemes. Typically used to measure wood and detect pipeline leakage, the SRTYH listening device has a high sensitivity metal probe equipped with improved sound quality headphones, allowing you to listen through wood, brick walls, <laughs> windows, doors, and even through armor panels. This device technically also enables users to listen through walls, allowing you to pick up even the most minute noises in the other room. Wow. It has built-in lithium batteries with its compact design, allowing for easy operation and convenient carry anywhere. Number five, pocket chip. In this age of smartphones and portable computers, it's remarkable to note that some gadgets were considered well beyond their time and were even shelved so as not to disrupt the existing market. The Pocket Chip was one such device. Touted as the Raspberry Pi killer, the Pocket Chip is a portable, battery-powered Linux computer with a QWERTY keyboard. At just 0.01 ounces, it has a 4.3-inch screen with a 4-gig hard drive size and a full-sized USB plug, as well as GPIO pin breakouts across the top for simple electronics projects. It runs real Linux and has the standard feature Pico 8 Fantasy Console, which allows you to code your own games and modify codes of other games you download. Many professional programmers started by tinkering with games, and this experience is placed front and center with the pocket chip. Number 4. Mini GPS Tracker most gadgets nowadays are equipped with trackers which allow you to determine where they are when you misplace them. Another great use for these trackers is in the realm of surveillance, such as tracking vehicles in real time. The GF07 Mini GPS Tracker is a magnetic device that can be attached to any metallic surface such as that of a car or a truck. Yeah. Do you think you'd be able to put one in a suitcase? You know, You've like got the AirPods, haven't you? Yeah, I know, but do you think one of those would be worth putting in a suitcase? That if it gets lost, you can find it. You've got the Apple ones to do that. Yeah, we well, don't have to. It would just be Apple. Same. Oh yeah, yeah. It'll track you. will track anything. Well, it's a tracker. Yeah. So you can put it in saying. a suitcase. But you, like I say, you might as well buy cheaper and buy the Apple ones that are the legal. These are saying the illegal. Yeah. It's cheaper. Making it you easy to it. hide and perfect for tracking vehicles. It has two powerful magnets that attach to vehicles firmly with no extra installation required. To acquire GPS coordinates for the tracker, you'll need to use a working SIM card inserted into the device, which can then be tracked in real time over the internet, such as on Google Maps. You can also use the device to listen in on your subject, which can be done by dialing the SIM card number, which prompts the device to turn on its microphone, allowing you Ooh, to hear sound weird, around it? the tracker without any light or right. noise from the device. This device is small and lightweight, making it perfect for a variety of uses. Number three, mm. night vision. So that, do you know when you see all these celebrities get um, listened in on? Is it something like that they're using? Do, possibly. It's, it's definitely a, a, an option that they, they could be using some yeah. kind of device like that. I often wonder how, how, how do they listen to them? Like well, there'd be some kind of like a phone hack or you know things like that. You know, there's, there's a lot of issues that went on over here with people's um, voicemails, yeah, and phone hacking mm. and all that kind of stuff. But that's uh, that's actually listening to real time conversation, conversations, isn't it? Yeah. Mm. These are cool. I'd definitely buy these. Night vision goggles. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> what for? Just because it's just cool, isn't it? On the balcony. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> vision goggles. An item you wouldn't expect to have is something that's mostly military in nature, but has somehow immersed into commercial use as well. These night vision goggles, which are now mainly used for hunting or for community watch, allow users to clearly see in the darkness, with seven levels of adjustable illumination and an all-optical system that helps you see animals and plants clearly in the total darkness or dim ambient lighting. It can be used to take photos, record videos, and it can be used for immediate playback. It offers high-definition photos and videos with outstanding clarity no matter what the time of day. If used for hunting, the motion detection function can be turned on, with its anti-shake function to assist in stable viewing. With this device, hunting at night or keeping your community safe is now a 24-hour workday. Number 2. Keychain Knives one would think that knives would be hard to come by online, especially really sharp ones. In fact, there's a multitude of options when it comes to this weapon option, but in a more fashionable keychain package. 
These keychain knives come in different shapes and forms, often with highly reliable bangles that can hold on to your most valuable keys. But its most discernible feature is the easy to unfurl pointy knife that's included. These tools offer high quality fold out locking knives from petite pocket knives to interesting pocket knife sets with different designs. One thing's for sure, no one's gonna try to grab for your keys with these. Number one, <laughs> security tag magnet remover. Most retail stores are equipped oh, yeah. with security magnets placed on individual items that are detached at the counter upon purchasing. Bringing these magnets through the door will prompt an alarm which could alert security. But while passing through the door may be the first hurdle, there's actually a gadget you can purchase online that can remove those magnets altogether. This magnet remover allows you to take off tags of various sizes and shapes with an easy to understand manual that can help you use the device efficiently. What do you think about these illegal mm. gadgets you can buy? We'd love to hear what you think about them by comment. Mm. <clears throat> Some of them are there, there for, for criminal activity, aren't they? I was going to say, yeah, if them, you go into they? a changing room with like five dresses, take the security tag off all of them, tell the assistant, yes, I'm buying them, and then walk out. You can just walk out the shop with them. You're way you? advanced in security uh, theft, you are, gay. You could be a security guard. You could pass that test. <laughs> <laughs> what do you reckon the coolest nowadays, gadget you just, was Nowadays, there, you just walk out with them. Yeah. Whether the alarm's going off or what, they don't give a shit. No, I know. Mm. Coolest gadget out of them all there. I think the um, the night vision goggles. Yeah, I think so. Or the little uh, human camera on yeah, the tie. Yeah, tie pin thing. Yeah, yeah they're all there. Uh, they see why they're illegal. They're all there for the wrong reasons, aren't they? Yeah. But uh, we do like gadgets, like I say, but I don't think I'll be using any of them. I Nothing don't know. I might go and nick a few dresses. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine me trying to steal something? I'd be sweating, I'd be bright red. <laughs> You'd be crying before you got to the door. <laughs> You'd be Do giving you them dresses back. I stole these five, but here's another six from your wardrobe that I've never wore. <laughs> yeah, anyway, hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll catch you on the next one. Cheers. Bye. Cheers.